Hello everyone and welcome. Today uh, I'm just going to to show you the known issues that are in Silov. And so far they are only one and only one that I wasn't able to to fix it and I don't think I will ever be, but it's not such a big deal, so let's get right into it. So as you may know, uh, we can uh, uh, put our game code inside a .zip file and load it from there. So I prepared this uh, example. So as you can see, we have archive.zip and boot.lua and silo. Uh, if you don't know how to create this or what I'm talking about, just watch the first tutorial where I explain you uh, what this stuff do. So let's open up the boot at Lua. And now, as you can see, we have lobda file system that sets source, which is going to set the source to this archive. So this is where the main that Lua uh, exists and basically our game code. After that, we require that directory. And after that, we require the main that Lua inside that uh, directory. So let's run it. And as you can see, we got uh, yeah. And sorry for the FPS. If my FPS is bad because of um, the recording, so as you can see, we have this um, this stuff showing up on the screen, which is exactly what I coded. But there is a problem with this. It's a problem that you can't fix because, as you as a Lua developer, you can't fix. Uh, so you just need to to learn the problem and adapt to it so let's open up let's open up uh, main.lua okay so let me explain you something um, first of all every time no, let, let's go here okay um, so yeah every time when you are inside the main.lua you need to uh, put these files which is going to set the, 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 the sorry it's going to set the directory where everything is uh, once the that zip file has been loaded and after that how do you load your um, game files well it's very simple the game files and when I say the, the game files I'm not referring to the libraries I'm I'm referring to those files, to these files, which uh, which are only visible here, which are only visible here. So near the main that Lua file. So when you are going to use um, files that are near uh, main that Lua, you need to use law of the file system that require and then the name in my case global which is this or uh, sometimes this file this uh, this line of code which is referring to love that system that require lib which is inside the lib as you can see inside the lib i i have uh, those classes these classes but sometimes you won't be able to to load it and your the whole framework is going to crash so that's why you need to do in that case you just need to do require require and yeah that's that's all so yeah when when you are dealing with libraries you are going to use uh, require simple require but with the game uh, source code which is near main that lua you need to do love the file system that require and also if you are going to use require simple require then the folder which contains the files you require from need to be placed here so as you can see you can uh, see the source code from the library but you can see from the from the game which is packed here inside yeah so if you have any more issues or questions, then uh, leave a comment or maybe an issue on my GitHub page. So thank you for watching. Bye.